Hi there. I'm here with my friend Callie. Callie, do you know what next Tuesday is? Huh? Do you know? Do you like meat, meatloaf? You do. You like meatloaf. Tuesday, the 18th, we're having Senior Adult Fellowship. We're featuring meatloaf and all the trimmings. So bring your meat, favorite meatloaf or some dish that goes with it. An old kitchen appliance or recipe, and we're going to have a bunch of fun. See you Tuesday, the 18th at 11. Don't miss out on the opportunity to be a part of our upcoming Community Service Day, Servolution, on Saturday, May 6th. There will be a wide array of service projects so that everyone can participate, no matter your skill level. Some of the many service projects that we will be participating in will be a painting project for City of Texas City, preparing kids' packs for Galveston County Food Bank, repairing of Harvey Homes with 4B Disaster Relief, and preparation of sleeping mats for the homeless. We will also be partnering with City of Lamarck as well as a new nonprofit organization, Everybody's Place, in the League City Dickinson area for projects. To participate, please sign up online on the church's website. To guarantee a t-shirt, please register by April 16th. If you already have your t-shirt from last year, please register by April 30th to participate. Don't miss out on this opportunity to serve our community together. Summer is an exciting time at First Baptist Church. Registration is now open for summer camps, music camp, vacation Bible school, sports camp, all those things. You need to sign up now because those slots fill up pretty quickly. You can register at fbctc.com. The FBCTC app has finally launched. Let's take a look. In our app, you will have the opportunity to watch our live stream, view previous services, fill in sermon notes, give, submit prayer requests, register for events, and so much more. But before we get too far into this, we want to make sure we get you set up correctly so you get the most out of the app. Go ahead, grab your phone, open your app store, and search FBCTC to download. When you open the app for the first time, you will need to create an account by clicking that little person icon in the top right. It is important that you click the email option, not the Google or Apple option, when creating your account. Next, let's make sure those notification settings are on so you can receive all the church-wide updates. Click that account button at the top right again, scroll down to notifications, and make sure that toggle is green. When you're all set up, feel free to explore the app after the service.